So there's right there. your town. That's my Nestved. town. Nestved. Yep. Which is 15 kilometers from here. Yep. Right. So that's about 10 miles. Let's check it out. All farms. He was basically uh, shot to pieces. The moment you uh, came on Facebook, this is the harbor area. Oh wow. And uh, this is basically... Look at a giant church off. up there. Yeah. Or some beautiful churches. Yeah, they all have that tower. Yes. With that kind of uh, step look. Yeah. And see, it's got a clock on the side of it too. Yeah. I see a theme. All right, so this is another mythical character with uh, kind of a unusual <laughs> superpower. <laughs> yeah, well, how much, how much can you say on your videos? <laughs> well, I may have to... Censor it a bit. Yeah. yeah. How do I get All right, forward? friends, this is Arjan's son right here. He's uh, going to hang out for a yeah. little while. You doing good? Yeah. You having a good day? Yeah. You warm now? Yeah. Okay, good. Hi, hi Sheila. Your heart hands Alexander. So we're going to go see a, uh, is it a Denmark-wide character? It's, no, it's a local character. So it's a local she character. She comes from this area. And it's called? Re Slattenpatten. Slattenpatten, yeah. And the deal is that she has this mythical superpower yeah. that deals with a part of her body, or two parts of her body that would be identical, generally. That's correct. Is yeah. that so? Yeah, that's... Can we go take a look at Slap and Pappen yeah. and maybe try to understand what this superpower is? Yes, let's okay. do that. All right. Let's do that. Let's yeah. go. So this there's is, a beautiful this is a church. Monastery. Oh, this was a monastery. That part. That looks like a monastery. Beautiful. Monastery. And is this a river yeah, or? Yeah, a river. And the story is actually quite uh, interesting because in the 60s they, uh, they closed it with garbage. And then in recent years, about 10 years ago, they decided that that's, that was not the right thing to do. So they restored it. They restored the what original. What do you mean they river. closed it with garbage? They filled it in? They filled it in. Wow. Yeah. yeah. And uh, about 10 or 15 years ago, they brought it back to its original state. Wow. So, uh, and it looks much better that way. Yeah, I bet. So when they filled it in with garbage, yeah, they just filled it in and then poured concrete on top of it, or uh, no, no con concrete, just garbage and stuff, and uh, and so actually, it was an eyesore, and actually, and also uh, toxic materials, oh. because there used to be a paper factory here. So it was ugly to the eye. Uh, not to my knowledge, because of course they made it look nice. So they so did. They planted grass on yeah, top grass of it or whatever. Stuff, okay. Yeah. Not like slap and pappa. Nope. Not like Slap and Pappen. But she's, uh, you were trying to be nice about Slap and Pappen, but you were saying that she was ugly as sin. Well, that's funny because there, if you look online, you find many different depictions of her, many different uh, photos, or not photos, but drawings. But they are all very different. But the one thing where they all come together is that she was butt ugly. <laughs> There's no other way to say it. She was butt ugly. Okay. There's the church. Yeah. Look at those lions there. Monastery. It's beautiful. Straight from Graceland. Looks like it. Those are just laying down. Yeah. Well, they need to rest every once in a while. Yes, indeed. And it seems like Slap and Pappen yeah. is somewhat related to the church. Yes, yes. There are depictions of her in uh, some of the churches here. Correct. This is uh, St. Peter's Church. Is this St. Peter right here? No. This is Slap and Pappen? No. This is an interesting story because we have this uh, hill where, we, uh, where there were a lot of trees. But at one point the trees... Uh, uh, got infested on somehow, and then there was an artist that uh, uh, cut uh, monks out of them, 
and it's this hill with this whole series of monks on them. And uh, this is a, re a replica of one of those monks. Wow. This is uh, from the original. They made a mold out of it. Yeah, it looks like wood because it's yeah. split. Well, that's what it originally was. So they just... But uh, they were kind of uh, concerned about these figures because at some point they started to uh, decay. So uh, they made these molds of them to uh, preserve them for eternity. And to make them look yeah. like they were wood. Yeah. Because it almost looks like it was charcoal. Well, this, this is what it was. So uh, they were made of wood. But uh, these, um, these particular ones are made of... Uh, well, it's... It's metal of some kind. Very cool. Yeah, let's find that lady. So, watch out. This looks like we're downtown Disney. And this is, more or less, this is a hotel that's uh, quite renowned here. It's old style hotel. I've had uh, people who stay here, like Dick Rope stayed here. Really? Yeah. And stunned. The basement of this hotel is from the. It looks great, and it's from the 14th century. So we're gonna see slap it happen. Yes. About to. What is this? Which one? It's grapes. Well, it, this is a wine uh, wine store. So that's. Those are grapes. Yeah. Not sour ones, I hope. This is a church street. So. Kirche Kirchstrade yes. is church. Street, yes. St. Peter's yes. Kirk. So it's talking about the church. Yep. Wow. What is this Rush? That's the second time I've seen that. I think it's Rush. What is it, Rush? The band? Rush? No, no. What do you think it is? That's R U S K. Just some guy's name. So maybe it's their tag it's name. Tag I've name. seen it yeah. uh, earlier. Yeah. A lot of tagging. This is the town square. And it's basically, of course, there's some new buildings there too. But the, the core of it has been uh, the same for more than uh, 100 years. <laughs> the statue, uh, it was uh, put here about 10 years ago and it has been controversial. Uh, there's many people that have mixed feelings about it. Um, so there's that. It looks like it was meant to have water coming out of it. There's water coming out in the, in the summer. It is. Uh, oh, okay. So looks, this looks catches like there's it. water coming out. Because yeah, I can see fountains yeah yeah so so friends you have to use your imagination um slacking slapping patten slapping patten means yeah, sagging and uh, if you could imagine what part of the body this is and she used those to well she used those to uh, defend herself with and uh, she was actually quite adept at it she used uh, her Breast that was her superpower. To, to beat beat other people up with. That's what she did. <laughs> that was her superpower. <laughs> That's what. And, so much so that she, she was a, actually she was actually uh, a nasty piece of work. Uh, to, <laughs> just to put it out, uh, you know, uh, straight. And these are her daughters, and they were apparently just as Ugly. awful uh, in every sense. Yes. And it's, so I mean, and she's there's nothing pretty. About. No, absolutely. Actually, the head looks like a fish of, of some kind. It really does. It's it's like a fish. So she looks like Poseidon a little bit. And the daughters, they look like, well, it's not something you would like to meet at a bar. Let's just put it that way. Like death warmed and, over. And that one looks like a clown. Yeah, well, a oh, sad right. clown. Yeah, sad clown. On, on the back side of this statue, which you cannot show, there's some of her lovers in various states of excitement. <laughs> well, yeah, we definitely cannot show that. <laughs> no. Actually, so, uh, there was a, uh, th they had a, a plate here uh, telling the story, but it's it's like uh, the 
Yeah. It's like they don't know what to do with the story. They don't know what to do it. So <laughs> they, they want to tell it, but they don't know how to tell they it. They don't know how to tell it. So they took, uh, there was a plate here uh, telling the story of Slatenpatten, but they removed it. So it's, but it's a, it, it's a, it's, it's a controversial piece of work. Uh, there's a lot of people that just don't like it. Well, it's not pleasant to look at. No, it's not pleasant. I will say that. Not pleasant to look at at no. all. And so, well, on the other side, it gets real bad. Well, well indeed it does. Yeah, it's... <laughs> <laughs> what in the world? Well, you're not the first. <laughs> all I can ask is why? Well, you're not the first. <laughs> yeah, that's all I can say. You're not the first. It's... it's uh, when it was uh, first, uh, when this one uh, was, uh, what do you call it? Unveiled. Unveiled. There were a lot of people having these feelings like, well, you know, mm, do I want this? Uh, do I want to have this in my town square? Yeah, the answer is no. Uh, no, no. <laughs> that's that's so. And uh, wow. Yeah. I didn't see that. Coming. And apparently, uh, on purpose, they are exposing it to the elements of nature. Obviously, 15 years ago, it didn't look like this, but they've just let it be so exposed. So it's been here 15 years. Yeah, about 10, 15 years. Yeah. <laughs> they're they're exposing it to the elements of nature just to emphasize its full ugliness. Well, it looks like there too. They're they're they have a theme going here in the square. Well, here, right here's the courthouse. So here you have the apotheque, the pharmacy. Oh, is that what that is? A pharmacy? A pharmacy. I love apotheque. Lion. That means so, lion. Oh, love means lion. means lion. Yeah, love means lion. Wow, okay. Yeah. I lion you. Lure. 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 Yeah, lion. Huh. You can also see a lion right there. Yes. No, I don't want to Interesting. This is a beautiful square. It's a nice square. But I'm serious, guys. This is just like being at Disney. It's just real. So I, I want to do a, uh, a video here real quick and just tell the story. And I see that they have lat latitude and longitude yes. lines marking and this the spot. Is, and this is the, the logo of the town, the town logo of the city of Nestor. So that's made specifically for the city. Yep. The stone uh, here. Hmm. Oh, the oh, and there's things written on there. Yeah, I'm actually I'm doing it upside down. It's actually supposed to be this way. Interesting. And if you're new to this channel, Adventures of the Spa Guy, I have more than 600 Elvis videos. And don't forget to check out my sidekick, Globe Trotting with Trey. He has over 150. And we both focus on true Elvis stories and what really happened. So if you want to support this effort, make sure that you subscribe, like, and then join. That helps us to get more videos out there. Yes, it does.